What up, what up, what up? What's going down with it? You know, I had to come through real quick. You know, um, I, I got an answer to my brother. You know what I'm saying? Um, it ain't about nobody worrying about Durant. And yeah, I did say I'm a clowny. And I said I'm a clowny, for one, because I am. Because these NBA players, you know, they jump on these, these hate bandwagons. They even drive the buses to these bandwagons. They don't have a problem with somebody that they know that everybody's saying fuck because they say fuck. But see, that's why you should never engage in stupid shit when it comes to this NBA thing. And yes, I'm a clown, Duran, because... The, you know, even though, even though he can't control where he go, this is just another team that beat his ass. And now he going to join. Get traded to him how, however it wants to be. See, all this shit ain't nothing but karma to Kevin Durant. When you sit around and you're a part of hate trains, when you lead hate trains, when you sit up and you make accusations and you say shit in the media, shit like that comes back to haunt you. Shit comes back to haunt you. See, we got to look at Especially with the LeBron hate train. Niggas paid for them hate trains that they went aboard on. It maybe didn't happen yesterday. It maybe didn't happen last week. But in some shape or form, niggas paid for being a part of that fuck LeBron train. You know, Kevin Durant and and um, Steph Curry, Clay Thompson, my nigga. She had Iggy. Everybody thought that shit was funny. Yeah, go to state won the championship this year, but look what happened. They had to be set the fuck down for a couple years and be trashed. People turning their backs on them that claim that they was fans. See, Steph Curry, he had to feel that LeBron effect. Klay Thompson had to feel that LeBron effect. Draymond Green had to feel that LeBron effect. Kyrie Irving had to feel that LeBron effect. Durant. All of these dudes. So that's why I said, if he go to Boston, I'm clowning him. Because all this shit is is nothing but karma. Yeah, Durant can't help where he go where he going, but this is karma. That's why I said I'm a clown his ass. This is straight karma. So, <laughs> you know, shout out to my brother, man. You know what I'm saying? I see, I seen your video, and I, you know, I seen what you what you wrote me. You know, this is my response to you, bruh. You know what I'm saying? This ain't got nothing to do with clowning him. He can't help where he go. This is about clowning his bitch ass for the karma. 
Because this is what he's feeling now. See, Steph Curry and them, they didn't got their karma for the bullshit that they was on. Durant's karma is just, it's just taking a little bit more time to ram up against his ass. Because I don't feel sorry for him. See, what Durant should have did was, you wanted to go to Golden State? That's cool. But once you seen that it was a fuck LeBron train, bro, you should have shut the fuck up. See, a situation like that, you should have just shut the fuck up. I, I will say shut the fuck up and dribble. That's what you should have did, Durant. You shouldn't have roved away with everybody else or none of that shit. You wanted to ride the wave. It was cute. Now look at you. Now look at you.